How to install eSign without using a computer and other applications. Now I will tell you everything in this video. Go to the Telegram channel Talker Health. I attached many links in the pinned comments. Look there, in the channel Talker Health there is a lot of useful information. And there is also a link to the storage pod, which issues personal certificates. Click on start, then click check it. Enter your phone identification number. You can find out this number when you order yours. Personal certificate here it gives you your personal certificate. Click get certificate. Wait a few seconds and the certificate will be issued in the form of two files. One of the files is called P12, the second file is called mobile provision. You can see them now in front of you, the password for these files is written below. Then follow any convenient link. Click on start, this is a boo for signing applications, click on sign and or sign EPA and the bot will give you a new push notification. Where there will be an inscription another, that is, HOTER, click on it, and then the bot will request the P12 file. Return in the upper left corner, select the first file. Cert. P12 click on forward it to the bot. The bot can be called differently, for me it is iDeploy. You send the attached file to the bot for signing. And if everything is correct, the bot will ask for a password. P12, I remind you that it is written there, I have one. You may have another number or another value. If the password is suitable, then in this case the bot will request mobile provision. It is located below the file set, P12. This is what mobile provision is called, also select it and forward it to the bot for signing. As you can see, everything is very simple and does not require any special skills. If everything is correct and the certificate files are combined and the password is suitable, then the bot will request the IPA file, this is the application file. There is a sign, which is important to send to the bot now. In the Talker Help channel there is a link to the archive of SPA files. There is also a fresh e-sign file, if you want to find it, click on the icon, click on search. In the form of English letters, e-sign, and then using the navigation buttons in the right corner below. Here you can just scroll through to find the same ESIG file. When you find it, also select it, click forward to the bot for signing after that. As soon as the bot receives the file all the certificate files with the password, it will display a push notification, where it is important to click sign or sign. After that the bot will send these files for signature in a few seconds of waiting. And you will see how you will have an already signed file. Click install, then click on the button below. Close the ad that will appear for you click on the download button. After loading the application for installation, push notifications will appear, where it is important to click the button. Open another push notification will appear, where it is important to click the install button. You the automatic installation of the application on your iPhone will begin. Wait a few more seconds and minutes, although you can just spend this time to save the certificate files on your iPhone. And they will still come in handy, and in general it is useful when these files are on your iPhone. Go back to the Telegram channel Tucker Help. To do this, just click back a few times. Also subscribe to Toker Mode and because we post the latest ones there and by file. Well, in Toker Mod find the bot again where you receive the certificate files. Select them, select two files at once at the bottom you will have a button with an arrow share. Click share and then click save files. After that remember the place where you save. I create a separate folder, this will be a new folder. Just hold down in a free space for a few seconds. A folder appears and you give it a name, I called it certificate. In the upper right corner click save. The files are saved to your iPhone and as you can see eSIM also installed on my iPhone. Run it, the first time it may not run. Try a second time, then click on the three dots in the upper right corner. Click on import find the same folder where you save the certificate. You will need exactly two files, and you will have three. The first file is the same cert. P12, then import the mobile provision file. It is in the same folder where you saved it. It also has a blue gear on the icon. Then click on the imported file cert. P12 you will be asked for a password. Click enter the password, and if everything is done correctly, it will be written that it was imported successfully. In the certificate manager you will see your certificate. Now you can sign any IP files directly through with.